Hello, how are you? This is Father Sok Villegas, greeting you from the Archdiocese of Linga and the Gupan. Welcome to the Light of Faith. Many of us are searching for Jesus. We want to meet Jesus. We want to know Jesus. We want to follow Jesus. There are so many who say they have found Jesus. There are so many who say they have found the Lord. Jesus is my Lord. Jesus is my friend. Jesus is my God. Jesus is my Savior. Jesus is my Redeemer. Jesus is everything for me. But how can you really find God? At the moment of his death, there were three persons who recognized Jesus. First, there is the Roman centurion and Pontius Pilate. Both of them said, Jesus the Nazarene, King of the Jews. This knowing Jesus came from political power. The Romans were the superpowers at the time. The Romans were the Chinese and the Americans and the Russians put together during those days. They had power over the lives of people. They can send people to jail. They can send people to death. They can extend the lives of people. They had political power. And they saw Jesus and they said, Jesus claims to be king, and this is a crime. The first people who recognized the kingship of Christ were the Romans, politically powerful Romans. The second type of people who recognized the Lord were the Jews. They were not powerful, but they felt favored. They were the chosen people chosen from among the others. The Jews were a little bit proud, almost arrogant, about their being the favorites of God. And they also said, Hail, King of the Jews. They recognized Jesus, but it was a recognition with disdain. It was a recognition coming from pride, from arrogance. The third person who recognized the Lord was the thief. He had no nationality. People did not like to be associated with him. But he also said, Lord, remember me when you come into your kingdom. To whom did the Lord respond? He did not respond to the kingship declared by the Romans who considered him a criminal. He did not respond to the kingship declared by the so-called favorites of God, the Jews. He responded to the declaration of his kingship made by a repentant thief. In other words, my, my dear brothers and sisters, it is the humility of this thief that made the recognition of Jesus most pleasing, most acceptable. You're looking for Jesus, you will not be able to find Him if you are proud. You're looking for Jesus, you will not be able to find Him if you are arrogant. You're looking for Jesus, the first step for you to recognize Jesus is to first say, Lord, depart from me, I am a sinful man. My lips are unclean. My hands are blooded with my own sins. Depart from me, Lord. I am a sinful man. And let the Lord raise you up. Let the Lord pick you up from where you have fallen and bring you back to His loving embrace. My dear brothers and sisters in Christ, 
you and I are looking for Jesus. We can only find Jesus with a humble heart. Because those who look for Jesus with pride and arrogance will only see themselves and not the Lord. Today, let us beg the Lord for the grace to see Him face to face. To see Him every time He visits us. He is my King. He is my God. He is my Savior. He has saved me from sin. I am a miserable sinner. He looked at me with mercy. He called me and He loves me. My dear brothers and sisters in Christ, seek the Lord while He can be found. Thank you for your question. Thank you for helping us to guide you. Keep sending your questions so that we can help you grow in our love for the Lord, so that we can help you deepen the light of faith that God has given you. Thank you very much. God bless you. Let us pray for one another.